Now, of course, people ask me all the time. They say to me, what is the secret to success? The first rule is trust yourself. And what I mean by that is, is so many young people are getting so much advice from their parents and from the teachers and from everyone. But what is most important is that you have to dig deep down, dig deep down and ask yourselves, who do you want to be? Not what, but who? And I'm talking about not what your parents and teachers want you to be, but you. I'm talking about figuring out for yourselves what makes you happy, no matter how crazy it may sound to the people. So rule number one is, of course, trust yourself no matter how and what anyone else thinks. And of course, rule number two is break the rules. We have so many rules in life about everything. I say break the rules, not the law, but break the rules. It is impossible to be a maverick or a true original if you're too well behaved and don't want to break the rules. You have to think outside the box. That's what I believe after all. What is the point of being on this earth if all you want to do is be liked by everyone and avoid trouble? The only way that I ever got any place was the breaking some of the rules. Which of course brings me to rule number three. Don't be afraid to fail. Anything I've ever attempted, I was always willing to fail. You can't always win, but don't be afraid of making decisions. You can't be paralyzed by fear of failure, or you will never push yourself. You keep pushing because you believe in yourself and in your vision. And you know that it's the right thing to do, and success will come. So don't be afraid to fail. Which brings me to rule number four, which is don't listen to the naysayers. I mean, how many times have you heard that you can't do this, and you can't do that, and it has never been done before? As a matter of fact, I love it when someone says, no one has ever done this before, because then when I do it, that means that I'm the first one that has done it. So pay no attention to the people that say it can't be done. You gotta love it, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta love it, it's gotta be what you are supposed to do. You want to sing, and even though they want to invite you to Carnegie Hall, you're going to sing to anybody that listen to you, including singing to yourself. You got to write, even if no one published your book, write because that was given to you to do. You do what it is you're supposed to. You're supposed to build something. You're supposed to create something. I don't know how to do it. Learn. Do whatever is required. It's necessary. If you want it, you got to go into action. You got to be willing to experiment. You got to be willing to fail and to succeed. You got to be willing to form and to develop new relationships. It's you, it's on you. You got to make that happen. Nobody's going to bring it to you on a civil platter and say, here's your dream manifested. No, it's hard. Yes, it's hard. It's difficult. That's right. And it's worth it. And that brings me to rule number five, which is the most important rule of all. Work your butt off. You never want to fail because you didn't work hard enough. I never wanted to lose a competition or lose an election because I didn't work hard enough. I always believe leaving no stone unturned. Muhammad Ali, one of my great heroes, had a great line in the 70s when he was asked, how many sit-ups do you do? He said, I don't count my sit-ups. I only start counting when it starts hurting. When I feel pain, that's when I start counting because that's what makes you a champion. That's the way it is with everything. No pain, no gain. Whatever it takes, I would do. That's the answer I want to hear from you. And if you do not see it, and if you do not believe it, who else will? That takes me to rule number six. Whatever path that you take in your life, you must always find time to give something back. Something back to your community, give something back to your state or to your country. Remember those six rules. Trust yourself, break some rules, don't be afraid to fail, ignore the naysayers, work like hell and give something back.